Hey guys, Pop Scrap here. Um, today I'm taking part of this um, kind of a serve you kind of. It's a more like I don't know what you call this a camera box or something. Uh, television CV made in the uh, United Kingdom it says. Uh, I think it's for cameras or something. So we're going to break it down and see what we can get in it. Uh, I'd say there'd be a good goal recovery in this. So we start off with cutting the plug off in that first. I like to strip everything down now more as I go because it's a lot easier for me to strip it down as I go. So to be less, how can I say, junk for me to overwhelm me. So nice bit of brass put that into the container for putting into the shed. What kind of it's a 13 amp fuse. I'm keeping these fuses guys and they're awful handy. Um at home, if something goes at home, like my washing machine always and tumble dryer for some reason keep blowing fuses. <laughs> I have a great selection of them, so I just change the route in straight away. It's very handy. So that's it. Bit of wire, more brass. Just a bit of wire out while I'm here. And that's the plug done. Cut the copper cable. Now it's number one wire for uh, the scrapyard. Unless I want to strip it, but I doubt it. Now, I was having a quick look at this before I played the video because there's a few Phillips heads. One, two, three, four, and in behind these, there's a Phillips head. So I'm excited to see what, what it's like inside for stripping. Uh, for gold, aluminium, brass, copper, who knows what's in it. Um, I think that's a, yeah, that's a heat sink. Nice little heat sink back here. So let's take off these Phillips screws. Um, I've got a great contact guys and there's a big massive hardware store um, where I live and they have a massive electrical store upstairs and massive containers of all electrical TVs and stuff and my brother-in-law to be is a manager there and he got me in there he has so tomorrow I'm going to bring you along with me um, I'm going to start stripping out old C uh, CRTV or uh, old TVs take the copper coils out of them, motors out of washing machines. We'll see how it goes. I'll give it an hour or two each day, well, a week, and uh, see how much I can take out of it. But it sounds too good to be true for me, it is, but we'll see how it goes. It's hard uh, for people to, you know, I find it hard to let me in like that, but we'll see. No, I should pop open so okay. take it apart bit by bit I'm gonna get too excited first um take these pop off the cable off um I've got a couple of mess uh, uh, me me messages in the comments saying do I keep the metal or iron scrap metal piece of wire I do I keep it at the back of the shed um, I don't want to show you it all it's just miscellaneous screws and from scrapping out these bits of steel once I have an I have a small trailer for my car once that's full I just bring it to the scrapyard you're talking about 30 40 euros at a time maybe once a week I don't go out looking for scrap steel because it's not worth my while um, okay some some nice IC chips in this lads so Pretty big IC chips. So we'll have a quick look at it now. I'm excited as you are to look at this and what's in it. So, just a piece of plastic. Are you ready for it? <laughs> well, not that much really in it. Um, we have a nice transformer here, which I'm going to take off now. Um, cut a few cables. The wire. Wire is important to me. Um, I get a lot of it. And at the end, at end of the year, it adds up so much for me. It does. Wire. <clears throat> Let's 
keeping an eye on the camera that you're around the place, that you're in the focus of the camera. And I want to say too to my subscribers, thank you very much for your comments and all your views. Um, I, to, I was already saying there a couple of weeks ago, I was, I'm a, thanks for the 100. And I'm up to 117 subscribers now, so I must be doing something right. Interesting for you. Um, I don't think this is actually a um, surveillance camera box. I don't think so. Uh, there'd be more stuff in it if it was, but it's hard to know. Nice. Heavy transformer, go with my transformers. Uh, what else have we got here to take off? Right. Trying to break down absolutely everything to get the most um, out of everything. I know it's time consuming, but believe me, I'd rather sit in there if I have I have the space for I have a big shed, so I have the space now for putting the stuff in. I'd rather leave it there sitting in a shed than half strip something out. Uh, let's see, is this worth getting into? Very much doubt. Now, some nice IC chips here. Or, um, yes, IC chips. Sorry, I get confused sometimes with all these chips. More piece of low grade wire. Uh, are these aluminium or steel? They're aluminium, so they're coming off. Right screw right for them in a second. Break that off actually. Uh, not fairly enough. Two pieces of aluminium. Now these chips. Try to screwdriver and read them maybe for a little pop up. Hmm. <coughs> I still got the flu. Look at these fellas, guys. There's so many in this board. For silver recovery. For them, that's mad. What's this little fella? Piece of aluminium, is it? Yeah, cool. Um, okay, these are good gold covering, uh, good gold plate on them, if you can see that. So I'll be taking that off now. Let me look through this board. These are not for easy chips to take off at all. Um, no, I'm going to have to get uh, mad with them in a few minutes. But yeah, I just want to I'm going to take this board off all together. Need a smaller Phillips. Have I got one here at the minute? Should have one. Uh, stuck in this box here, I got my screws. As I said, my drill is dead because I'm doing a lot of work today. I have been. Um, this should be one. Let's do. I know I should have all this ready guys before I start making the video but <clears throat> this is the joys of it. 
taking that one out here. Yeah. Strip this down completely because there is some nice gold plate now. So it is worth taking with me. And some nice icy chips in it. Now maybe there might be any gold in these icy chips, but I really uh, think there will be. So Screws off. And just pop out. One more top. Probably more screws hiding somewhere, but we can work with it. Now. Let's see. It's off like that. Ah yeah, some nice icy chips on this. A lot of icy chips in it. Um, icy chips guys and basically that them gold plate and pins. Very nice. So I'll put this to the side. It's not too bad value in that. Uh, we're just going to get this piece of aluminium off. Heat sink. Is it worth taking apart? Yes, for me it was. Um, got a nice transformer with this aluminium. So I'll check this because this can be aluminium sometimes. Steel. So, yeah, that's that stripped apart, guys. Easy enough to strip apart. Um, it's all really left with plastic and a tiny bit of a board that I don't really get value much of. And this little fella, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, six, yeah, six big chips really, and a shitload of small icy chips, and nice gold plate and pins. So that's it, guys, in that video. Um, I don't know what kind of board, what kind, of, what this is off. It's an unusual thing. It's an old um, electronic. So like, comment, subscribe, guys. Keep them subscribers going, and keep liking my videos. See you in the next one. Take it easy.